Ladies and gentlemen, guys and gals, welcome back to Age of Empires Definitive Edition, where we are now playing through the Yamato Empire of the Rising Sun campaign, since the game was patched a year after its release, and uh, the AI and campaigns do play a lot better now. And we're going into what I think might be the final mission, I'm not too sure, but it is mission 8. So let's go ahead and see what this next mission is going to be all about. Emperor Shomu, your great-grandfather, the Emperor Tenji, ended the power of the Soga clan by aligning with a minor courtier. In recognition of his aid, your ancestor bestowed the clan name Fujiwara to the courtier. Now, like the Soga they helped defeat, the Fujiwara have grown powerful and seek to dominate the imperial throne. One of their clan leaders leads a rebellion in Kyushu. Defeat him and restore the people's faith in your divine rule. Hmm, okay. Destroy the Fujiwara Revolt. I'm not sure what that means. Does that mean all units, all buildings? Let's check the hints. Establishing a base across the Kanmon Straits will allow you to more quickly bring troops to battle. The river in the west gives you access to the rear of the Fujiwara defenses. Ah. By the way, I've been playing this on... Uh, playing through this, and on YouTube, uh, there's, I've been receiving comments from, I think, the person who's been remaking these campaign missions. And all this history has been sort of rewritten, because apparently in the original Age of Empires game, a lot of it was just made up or wrong or just nothing. Anyway, we're playing on hardest difficulty, Fujiwara Revolt. Let's see. We might have to restart. Let's just try not to. On this. On this. Uh, you guys get to mining, you guys get to chopping, did we miss any? Okay, no. We have a couple boats here, we can start fishing, we have plenty of houses, here's our military. We are in the Iron Age. Uh, I need to just get some villagers going. Get another fishing ship. Use one archer, one composite bowman, to start checking things out. So, oh, there's a little crossing here. Oop. Gonna have to turn around that. And we're slowly gonna shift some of these woodcutters into farmers. What is this house placement? Oh, and attack here. I'm gonna shift into... Can you repair that? Ah. I'm gonna need to do some micro here. Oh, I lost! We're under attack already. What? Jeez. Okay. They just immediately immediately attack with all of that? Well, okay. That makes things a little difficult. So it doesn't really give us... Okay, okay. We have to get things going a little bit faster, but you know, maybe it's not over yet. Maybe it's not over yet. Go repair that. Go kill these guys. Let's upgrade to triremes. You are gonna come down here. Gonna build that here. Why are you not coming down this way, please? Can you kill those guys? Okay, keep chopping trees. I do have a priest. I did not realize. We're gonna bring a priest up. 
We're repairing this. We're gonna bring these guys back. So that we can repair him. Extra tower. Okay, that's good. We've got bigger ships. Probably should get a couple more of those. Horse archers are a good choice. Get a bit more gold mining going. These ships should keep things going a little bit better. Just fish a bit more, please. Get a couple of these guys. Increased accuracy. I definitely need that. I lost a villager on that. Okay. Okay. Not GG yet. Come on, don't get stuck. Okay, one, two, three. Uh, you are gonna... Get onto farming. You are gonna build another tower here. Is this an entrance? Oh, they're right there? That makes things. We're very sort of trapped in here. Here as well? Okay. We are just straight up trapped. Come back, please. Crowding some towers here. If they attack from the right, I'll just sort of lure them back. Got a couple more villagers on the back of this. More horse archers. Horse archer cavalry are a nice choice. Got a couple more triremes on the back of this. Get more farming going. Okay, we have a market somewhere, right? There it is. Market. Weapon range. Irrigation. Irrigation is going to be important. As we turn on auto reseed farm. And stick a tower here. Okay. Keep looking around for things here. No idle villagers. What's the range on these? 7 plus 2? 7 plus 2? We could start to outrange them by upgrading that. We have some military formed back. You can get onto farming there. Okay, with these towers we should be slightly better. Let's mine that gold. Got a new upgrade here. Oh, we don't outrange it quite yet. of those. I wanted to get increased accuracy because we're gonna be using quite a lot of archers here. That upgrade's almost done. Why? Sh thank you so much for joining. I know it's late for you. Okay, got a couple more fishing boats going. That upgrade's almost done, so we now should outrange the tower. I mean, we should outrange the tower, but... I'm just gonna micro this.
Now this looks important to keep. For me to do this. And then we can keep the... Build up the military here. Get that. Get some upgrades. Get another farm. We were starting to run out of trees, but... I want to be trading wood. Trading wood. Uh, you build a farm right there. Okay. Just put a storage pit right there. Start chopping these trees. We're going to mine out the gold soon. Are these all trading wood? Okay. You repair that. Okay. Grab a heavy catapult. Gold miners. Free tribute. Okay, we don't need that. Heavy horse archer. Jeez. Are we... Oh, we're supply blocked. Okay. Uh, catapult, trireme, we're gonna research that. These guys are now done. Just build a storage pit there. We're just gonna chop all these trees. You guys need to get to fishing. You can... We don't have a siege workshop, do we? Put a siege workshop down. And you, you. Did I get that? Right, population limit. What are we overdoing here? The wood, right? Oh, not four. Let's get a couple of those. Attacking from the coast will be good. So we're maxed pop right now. With a good size economy on the back of this. Prepare that, please. We lost the priest. It's fine. Let's kill them all. You guys are gonna be three. You guys are gonna be two. Two, three. What is this? Siege weapons. That frees up some supply. Okay. We can get a priest on the back of this. Some of those. Some of those. start healing up here. Let's hold 
the siege weapons back. Let's not lose this. Uh, two. Didn't realize we don't quite outrange the towers. We can get heavy horse archers, can't we? Oh no, we're out of gold. I see. Get some wood going. Heal up our troops. Gotta be a little efficient here. You guys are group three. There's a little bit of gold. I got it. So that means I do need a transport. I need a villager to go over there. Got him. Where's the... There it is. Let's group up these guys. There's too many traders, I think. I'm gonna cut one down. And we can now start expanding out this way. You guys just hit that. Don't we outrange this? Fine. Keep the catapults back. Here's a source of gold. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Where are you going? Okay, all the gold is over here. Okay, let's try. Send these guys over here. Now, didn't I get two villagers onto here? I did. There's actually berries over there. Plus one range for siege in the government center. Plus two engineering. No, stop that. Gotta wait for that upgrade. Okay, just on the back of this. Let's get that. Horse Archer upgrade. You guys are here. 
build a storage bit. No, 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 where are you going? Suddenly, they have a lot of troops. I'm gonna have to pull back. Where did all of this come from? Not enough gold, right? Uh, you guys, please mine gold. Oh no, you guys stop that. Please go kill all of this stuff. Jeez. You can start wrecking that. Okay. What is that? Jeez. This is very relentless. Gold is scattered everywhere, though. Okay. Did that give us extra range on siege? I think it did. 7 plus 3, that's 10, okay. I wanted to get alchemy. So we're low on gold. Jeez. Okay. Let's heal you guys up. Okay, we gotta find where this river leads. Should be somewhere useful. Oh, this is all shallows. Sail away! And we're trapped. Okay. Heavy horse archers, cavalry. Enough gold. Do you think I could possibly sneak that through? the economy going. I'm very bad at keeping the economy going, but... Just mine that. Go mine that. This is what survived here, okay. That's a lot of gold, which we can actually eventually get to. But 
this should keep things going. Oh. Infantry, armor, metallurgy. That's going to be important. So we have to destroy all siege workshops, docks, stables, archery ranges, barracks, town centers. If I just upgrade to heavy transport, get three of those. Just two, I think. We'll use this one. Then just one should do. Juggernaut. I don't think we need so much on the coast right now. Sneaking around the back should be better. Uh, do I want this? Stone miners? No. Academy units? No. I think I have all the upgrades I want. send this as an attack force to sneak around the back. Keep queuing up soldiers on the back, yeah? Cataphract. I think I should get it, right? I have enough food. I just need the gold. Supply capped. Okay, the 50 supply limit is actually pretty good, I think. Now if I just drop 20 of these units right into enemy territory, it should be pretty good. If I can get that cataphract upgrade first, it would be even better. Yeah. Of course, I've got all these units queued up. There's the gold. Just have those queued up. There we go. Upgrade's coming. You guys need to keep fishing. Okay, good. Guys, it's my favorite song. It's my favorite song, Cave. Well, the remastered version, my favorite song is a classic version, which should be an option in this game. All right, we're gonna do an attack. You guys are gonna be group three. I'm just gonna have to keep these queued up on the back. Or when that happens. Okay, you guys are just gonna attack, move down to there. Well, you guys need to try and get through here. This is a suicide mission. You don't need a way out. Time to fight. I think the cataphract upgrade came through. Yes. Bring up the archers. We should do pretty hefty damage. Let's grab a couple archers, deal with that guy, please. Ah, oh, so much damage! Try and make sure the economy is wrecked. Can we take out... the stable? The siege workshop? Take out the archery range. We're under attack a little bit. 
Farm there, please. Farm there, please. Take this out. Take this out. Take out the town center. So this should be their main base that we've wrecked the heart of. What is that? Academy. Okay. Take out the military production buildings. We win? That's it? They resigned! Wait, are they supposed to resign? They're not supposed to resign! I haven't finished my objectives! Fujiwara just gave up! They resigned, they GG'd. We don't even have the, the ending message. Because did we not technically win the mission? It must be a bug. The AI rage quit. <laughs> Um, and but wars and the intrigues of court weigh heavily on your spirit. You hope that with your victory and the weakening of the most powerful clan, you will be able to one day abdicate the throne in favor of your daughter. You will retire to a Buddhist temple to become a monk and walk the Eightfold Path. After all, with your victory, most assuredly, no clan will ever again dare to challenge the Yamato Emperor. All right. Well, uh, it counts. It counts as a victory. We finished the Yamato campaign. Um, it only took us half an hour because the AI gave up. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. We got to get back into that map. Enjoying Adrian Pacific? Rate the game and let us know. Now, Emperor Shum. What does this map look like? Did we really not miss all that much? Because there were definitely some docks. There was a dock I left standing. So, what didn't we destroy that was on. What oh, is an island there with resources? Nice. There's a dock here. So we have to destroy all enemy docks. So there's a dock there and a dock here that we didn't destroy. The rest was in the main base, right? So we did destroy siege workshop, stables, archery range, barracks, town center. It was just the docks. We haven't finished the docks unless they built more stuff. We got those. I'm not sure if they build more stuff on this map. I still can't believe the AI resigned. The AI resigned! I'm just too intimidating. Huh. They had zero pop at the end? I suppose, like, normally, you know, the AI would resign in a skirmish map, you know? I didn't even reload. That first invasion, I thought I was going to lose. Turns out, no, it's actually fine. Like, it was tough holding on, but once you just dump 20 units right here, uh, there's not much they can do. So, unless they built more buildings here, we did actually complete all but the docks objective. You win if there's no town center and they have no pop. Did we really get them to zero? But still, on a campaign map, they shouldn't be able to resign. If our objectives are to destroy all these buildings, I should be able to go around and destroy all those buildings. I like the map, though. 
there's just so many resources. I actually feel like there's too many resources, right? I was like, oh, we found an island with some gold on it. Yes, let's go get that. And then I realized there's some gold right there. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, you know, trading with their dock for the gold and everything. But there's gold everywhere on this map. Look at this. There's gold, 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 gold. Their base has gold. This has like a ton of gold. I thought we were going to be short on gold. Like, just with some of this and some of that, we had enough for pretty much the whole game. But oh well. That is the end of the... Though they defeated you, the Fujiwara are most gracious to you as emperor. Although they exiled you, they did allow you to be the ruler of your new home. On the northernmost tip of Japan, dress warmly. Yeah, they have some snarky, snarky ending messages there if you lose. But we have finished the Yamato Empire of the Rising Sun campaign. Bit of a shocker ending there, but uh, I think it still counts. I think it still counts because we, they were pretty much wrecked. We just had to go around destroying the docks. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it for now. Thank you all so much for joining and watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you'd like to see more stuff on the channel and watching on YouTube, you can click the buttons on the screen right now and you'll be able to see so much more stuff. Gamer encounters, nostalgia, um, so new games, old games, abandoned games, and of course more Age of Empires. Thank you all so much for joining and I will see you in the next video. Bye!